all, let's show Kath how easy it is to use. Sure, Kath. Looks very, very simple. Kath, just take with two fingers is all you need at the base. Okay. Okay. And if you place the base of it on your sternum just there and you'll yeah. notice it puts you in the I right position. Silly, but well, how do you know where your sternum is? Oh good is? question. Just... Very simple. If you creep up your chest bone you'll come to a soft bit at the top. Yeah, my that's bad. called the sternal notch. Dips in. Yeah. Just come below that and that's a nice solid hard piece of bone. Yes, yeah, so not in the soft bit. Not in the, the soft in the, bit. In the, in the just bit. below it yeah. onto that okay. at the top of the sternum. Yeah. And the, and Kath has it there perfectly. Don't look so worried. <laughs> it's actually fine. And then your chin rests on that chest plate there. That's perfect. Just fine. Now let's start the first exercise. I'm going to come around and see if our yeah, camera guys can pick up here, some right. muscle activity on this side. <coughs> okay, we're going to look at this side of your neck. All you need to do is it's nice to see you're smiling already. But just push down with Don't your worry, yeah, push it, push down with your all the way, perfect, and up, and do about ten, and then we'll ask you what you feel. While she's doing that, look, never used it before, but already the muscles are starting to fire up. What we call recruit, they're becoming, they're recruiting um, all the muscle fibers here. And as she pushes down, look, sternocleidomastoid's working, just as we saw on the other girls, and the long muscles at the side of the neck, and you can see the jaw area here starting to tighten as she pulls pushes down just here. But look at this deep area. This is the area that fascinates me because that's the area that you want to pull back. And see that crevice that's occurring there, that that tucking. Okay, four more. <coughs> four. Okay, yeah, come on. I want you to tell us what you're feeling. This is the neck exercise, everyone at home. Three or four sets of 15 and stop. Okay. Kath, how, how, how does that feel? <laughs> I can really feel that working. You can, can't you? I really can feel that working <laughs> down the sides. Excellent. And the thing is, because you'll, you'll be like me when I first did it, because before this, ha have you ever worked those muscles? If you think about it. it where? I, 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 I can't think of anything. No. No. See, so it's the first time probably in yeah. your 45 years that you're actually going to be using, you know, working these muscles. That's right, and that's why she's going to feel it. Tomorrow, yeah. usually 48 hours later, yeah. you feel it, uh, like with any exercise. Yeah. I don't know, if you exercise any part of your body, Kath, mm. I'm sure you felt like that muscle burn that you get, that yeah. nice warm feeling you get, that proves that you've targeted the area. Yeah. And I guarantee if you do four sets of 15 mm. or four sets of even 10 tonight, you will feel this yeah. the next day. I, I yeah. would, because you're right about that. I think start with the four sets of yeah, 10. Yeah, just four sets now, of 10. Now, the other exercise, I don't know if you're going to feel it, because I, I love the other exercise. Yeah. I don't know if it's because I can feel more muscles it, working. Well, Do you know, is that well, what it is? Or well, is it what, just... well, you might be stronger here than you are here. Also, Look, if you're weaker with the jaw, you'll have a double chin and saggy jowls. If they're the weakest muscles. Yeah. Uh, if you've got weak neck muscles, and some people have weakness in both areas, do both exercises. Now, the second exercise, Kath. Okay. First time for you again. Now you have to keep the that head right? yep, yeah, that position and the, the chin just on there. And now we keep the head still. Now watching as she opens and closes the jaw for me. Try ten. Now look here. If we've got the look at this up here around the jowl area. Oh, look at the activity, wow, nice that. and close, even at the top here, the jaw. If we can get that area there, Ooh, that is amazing. Look, yeah. that's what you need, Kath. Well, you, that's you're worried about those jowls, yeah. You're worried about those jowls. Keep going. Do about six more. One. So you can yeah. see those, can't Look you? Andrea, can you see those on this yeah. side? Amazing. Look, see that activity there? As she opens, now, I'm gonna go up even higher because look, her temporalis is working. Can we go even higher? Right up here where the temporal, where my pointer is. Look. Look oh, at that. Oh wow, look at that. That's temporalis working. Yeah. So if this works the whole side of your yeah. face, but you must have resistance look if you want to. Oh, and it's amazing because it's first nine time as well. Seven Andrew Sorry, made a very good going. point. Amazing. She so said for the eye line oh, oh, because really? it pulls back in around the oh, eye, the orbit. See, see how she worked one more. I know you're there. We go, and that's yeah, yeah. okay. That's the jaw one. Oh, so <laughs> that, that was a workout. Yeah. <laughs> do you? I think with that one, because you could, could you feel more yeah. muscles being worked? You think? Yeah. I, I, yes, muscles. I didn't realise yeah. I had. <laughs> Isn't that fascinating? Don't you think that's amazing though, that you can actually, so, because obviously with anything like, like you feel that it's worth doing something, mm. you're more likely to obviously, you know, mm. stay with it, aren't you? Yeah.